Hey book nerds, this is my haul for the week of I have no idea anymore because I've lost count. Um, so many things this week. I probably only bought like one book and the rest were like either from publishers and I also went to OLA so yay let's get started. I got this present from my sister staff so thank you. I saw this at chapters I didn't realize it was you know it was there so she got me this one and when I was there like last week I saw this floating bookshelf thing for like $12.99 and I saw it and I'm like okay I want that it looks cool because look it has like it's literally floating it's awesome and my Amazon purchases. If you follow me on Instagram, I saw the Sex and the City complete collection for $60. And yeah, I couldn't resist. I bought one book. Awaken by Kate Kavinsky. And I also saw this. TCM's Greatest Classic Films Collection. That includes Madame Bovary, Anna Karenina, Pride and Prejudice, and Little Women. I only seen Little Women and I thought it was really enjoyable and I saw this for $11.99 and I added it to my order, yay! And I'm on the vlog tour for The Shadow Wars by Rod Rees. And I got some arcs from Random House, Paperboy by Vince Vodder. And I was excited for this one, Starstruck by Rachel Shuker. This looks like it's the Golden Age. I believe that's the flapper edition, the flapper ear, I'm not sure. And the language inside by Holly Thompson. This is in verse, so yeah. I haven't read anything in verse yet. And I was supposed to be on the blog tour for Ava, Ada, Adams, reawake, revamped, sorry, revamped um, blog tour, but the books weren't coming out yet, so finally got it, so yay! And I got the second one because she's so awesome. This is Reawaken, so yay, these two covers are insane, I'm so excited. She also sent so much swag, so yay. <laughs> Thank you so much, Ada. And Simon and Schuster, yeah, the finished copy. Lauren DeStefano, it is gorgeous and it kind of matches my shirt, kind of, yeah, this is my favorite color of green. So yay, thank you, thank you so much, Simon and Schuster Canada. And I also had some gift cards from MR Merrick and YA Book Central. I used them on Through the Evernight by Veronica Rossi. And Boundless by Cynthia Hand. I am dying to read these. Like really start them right now. And then I kind of went to OLA, which is basically Ontario Library Association, so um, I did not realize that you can buy an expo pass, so I kind of went today and I came back with a bunch of books. So, yeah. The Lies We Lost by Megan Cruz. She was there and I got it signed because, yeah, she's so awesome. Like saw her again. Um, I'm really excited to read this because I really loved um, The Way We Fall. So yeah, they did a little cover change. I think this is the old version though. And City of a Thousand Dolls. Yes, I was dying for this one. Ah, Miriam Forster, I want to say, and Vicky. Vicky Van Sickle, who is also a Canadian author, and um, HarperCollins, um, she works at HarperCollins, she was tweeting about this saying that there is psychic cats, psychic talking cats, actually, so I was just like, what? Seriously? Yeah, I'm excited. 
And then, because Haley is really awesome, Haley from Booking It with Haley G, um, couldn't be there on Thursday. She got me a copy of Rush by Eve Silver. Oh, yes, this one, one of my go-to reads. I wanted to get it and kind of got damaged in my bag, but yay! I will meet you, Eve. Yes. And this one, I know, I was dying for this one, House of Secrets, by Chris Columbus and Ned the Zinni, I think that's how you say it. I am really excited. Um, this was actually blurbed by, I heard by, um, J.K. Rowling. So, yeah, and check out that cover. I just, I love middle grade children's covers. It's so nice. And another one I was looking at is Seven Wonders of Classes Rises by Peter Le Laurentius, I want to say. Um, I've seen a lot of advertising for this month, so yeah, I'm excited to start this because I still love reading middle grade books. And as I was going around all the booths, um, I believe Thomas Allen and Son this was from. I want to say. Um, one of the reps recommended this one, The Incredible Charlotte Sycamore by Kate Madison. She is also a Canadian author, so I like promoting Canadian authors. And this one is really funny because I was actually surfing on Goodreads and I saw this and I'm like, I want it. Forgive Me, Leonard Peacock by Matthew Quick. And I just really like this cover. It's pretty and simple and love it. And because Haley is awesome, she had an extra copy of The Lost Prince by Julie Kagawa. Thank you, Haley. And I spent the night with my best friends, Anna and Siobhan. Siobhan is kind enough. Yeah, I almost died. She yeah, she knows how much I wanted these ones. And The Goddess Inheritance by M.A. Carter. Yeah, I cannot wait. That cover is insane. Like, come on, that is a gorgeous shot. Makes me, like, so pretty. And the last but not least, yeah. The sequel to The Mortar Rules, Eternity Cure by Julie. Kagawa. Yes, I know they did the cover change, but yeah, it's not so bad, but um, it doesn't really like stand out. I don't know. What do you guys think? So yeah, that is my insane haul this week. Um, let me know what books you guys got or what books you're excited to get because I am, wow, I didn't even buy any of these books. Like, so bad. I will read them all. Trust me. Till next week, guys. Bye.